As a video editor, whether you're just getting started or you're at the professional level, you need a good quality computer mouse. My favorite one is the SteelSeries Rival 500. Here's why. Welcome to More Film Academy video editing series. Today we talk about my favorite computer mouse for video editing, the SteelSeries Rival 500. When I started being a serious video editor, it wasn't long before my wrist started hurting because of my crappy mouse. I then realized it's better to have an angle to the mouse to avoid carpal tunnel syndrome. At the same time, this would be a great way to speed up my workflow. After months of research, seriously, I do way too much research, I ended up buying the SteelSeries Rival 500. This has a perfect angle for my wrist and has 15 programmable buttons, all perfectly placed. So here's how I set up my shortcuts for Fallen Core Pro 10. B4 and B9 are for zoom in and zoom out. B13 zooms out to fit everything on the timeline. B6 expands audio. B7 is shift. This allows me, when I hold it, to scroll left and right instead of up and down. B10 is the transform tool. Now, you also need to be able to navigate on your computer efficiently. So I put the expose option on B8 and I change windows with B11 and B12. I find this to be very efficient. As you can see, I only put the most useful features for Fallen Core Pro 10 on the mouse. The rest are navigating features on a Mac. This is also part of video editing and productivity. That said, you could still program all of them for Fallen Core Pro 10 shortcuts if you prefer, or even add Fallen Core Pro 10 as a software in the Still Series app so that the controls change when using Fallen Core Pro 10. Also, all these shortcuts were on the keyboard before, but by putting them on the mouse, it saves energy and time. You never have to look down at your mouse. On top of that, on a keyboard, you often have to press two buttons instead of just one on the mouse. It doesn't seem like much, but trust me, it makes everything so much easier. Overall, this is one of the best investments I've made. It would be nice if there were a wireless option, but I kinda like the wire. It's long enough, and it's one less thing I have to worry about charging. I find the price might be a bit expensive for some people, but I assure you, this is a fantastic investment to speed up your video editing workflow and take care of your wrist. On top of that, this is a gaming mouse. So if you're also a gamer, it's even more worth it. A quick note, I recommend you also get the mousepad with wrist support. It really helps the overall ergonomics. You can find the links in the description. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.